think it is. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Trenches Politics TV. We definitely politic in front of trenches. Let's get it. The Philadelphia police are on the hunt for two women after they shot and killed a man inside the Dudley corner store. Two women on the run are accused of fatally shooting a man in the Point Breeze section of the neighborhood Monday night. Now, it all happened after 6.30 p.m. at the Federal Deli Market on the corner of 20th and Federal Streets. Authorities say a 35-year-old man was shot multiple times while inside the corner of store deli, but say officers found him outside on the ground. He was then transported to Jefferson University Hospital, where he later died from his injuries. Investigators believe the shooting happened after an altercation between a man and two women broke out inside the corner store deli. That's when one of the females pulled a handgun and fired at least five shots, striking the 35-year-old male victim at least four times, three in the torso and once in the leg. Police say the woman then ran in two different directions after the shooting. Officials say the women were captured on surveillance video and at least one of the women is known to come frequently in the corner store. And they also said they don't typically hear of female shooting suspects and don't know why the argument turned into a fight of two women versus one man. But let me know what y'all think though, gang. But make sure y'all hit that like button, set y'all notification, and drop a comment on the situation. And keep rocking with Trenches Politics TV, where you only politics in front of trenches. Let's get it. Philadelphia police tell us they are looking for two women accused of shooting and killing a man in Point Breeze earlier tonight. An area was roped off here at the intersection of 20th and Federal Streets as police started their investigation. Authorities say a 35-year-old man was shot three times and later died from his injuries. It's believed the shooting happened following an altercation near a corner store at this very same location. For two women who they say were involved in killing a man, the deadly shooting happened inside a corner store right across the street from the police station in the city's Point Breeze section. Action News reporter Corey Davis is live at 20th and Federal Streets with new information we learned overnight. Good morning, Corey. Matt, good morning. So this morning, police are telling me they could clearly see the two female suspects in surveillance video during that shooting inside the deli here. So the gates are down right now, but there are even surveillance cameras here outside the store as well, the corner of 20th and Federal Streets where we are. Investigators told me 17th Police District responded to radio calls and the precinct is right there, basically across the street from the deli. They say they don't typically hear of, female, of a female shooting, or especially or female shooting suspects rather, and they don't know why the argument turned into a fight. Uh, here's what happened when things turned physical. And that's when we know one of the females pulled a handgun and fired at least five shots, striking the 35-year-old male victim at least four times, three times in the torso, once in the leg. And bullet holes from those gunshots are in the windows here of the Federal Daily Market at 20th and Federal Street. Investigators say the two females ran in different directions after one of them shot the man. Chopper was above the scene just before 7 o'clock yesterday evening, shortly after police say it happened. Police also say the female shot the man while he was inside the corner store deli, but they say officers found him outside on the ground. We're told officers picked him up and rushed him to the hospital where he was later pronounced dead. So police are telling me this morning that they also learned uh, that at least one of the females involved in this goes to this corner store often. They haven't released a description of the female suspects or the name of the man who was shot and killed. And still at this hour, investigators telling us they're trying to figure out exactly what they were arguing about that ultimately led to that fight in the shooting.